Breast cancer, is cancer originating from breast tissue, most commonly from the inner lining of milk ducts or the lobules that supply the ducts with milk. Cancers originating from ducts are known as ductal carcinomas. Those originating from lobules are known as lobular carcinomas. Breast cancer is a disease of humans and other mammals. While the overwhelming majority of cases in humans are women, men can also develop breast cancer. The vacuum-assisted biopsy is a procedure for obtaining a tissue sample from areas suspected of being diseased body for the purpose of histological examination. Here, a fenestrated hollow needle into the tissue to be examined is introduced. The fabric is conveyed by means of vacuum suction inside the needle, where it is then separated and extracted. In most cases, the vacuum biopsy of the breast and the prostate is used. Under local anesthesia, the patient on a fissure table is examined in the prone position, wherein the respective breast hangs freely through a hole in the table down and in the desired plan perpendicular to the chest wall is compressed. Here's an example of how to get in a suspected cancer, by vacuum biopsy, a tissue sample. Now we fly through the breast to the cancer. Breast cancer, like other cancers, occurs because of an interaction between the environment and a defective gene. Normal cells divide as many times as needed and stop. They attach to other cells and stay in place in tissues. Cells become cancerous when mutations destroy their ability to stop dividing, to attach to other cells and to stay where they belong. When cells divide, their DNA is normally copied with many mistakes. Error-correcting proteins fix those mistakes. The mutations known to cause cancer, such as P53, BRCA1 and BRCA2, occur in the error-correcting mechanisms. These mutations are either inherited or acquired after birth. Presumably, they allow the other mutations, which allow uncontrolled division, lack of attachment, and metastasis to distant organs. Normal cells will commit cell suicide apoptosis when they are no longer needed. Until then, they are protected from cell suicide by several protein clusters and pathways. A biopsy is a medical test involving the removal of cells or tissues for examination. It is the medical removal of tissue from a living subject to determine the presence or extent of a disease. The tissue is generally examined under a microscope by a pathologist, and can also be analyzed chemically. When an entire lump or suspicious area is removed, the procedure is called an excisional biopsy. When only a sample of tissue is removed with preservation of the histological architecture of the tissue cells, the procedure is called an incisional biopsy or core biopsy. When a sample of tissue or fluid is removed with a needle in such a way that cells are removed without preserving the histological architecture of the tissue cells, the procedure is called a needle aspiration biopsy. Thanks for watching this video. This animation was created by Piranha DL. Akadeni both.